What's up everyone, today I'm gonna teach you how to draw Jimin from official BTS Chibi figurines. If you are new to this channel, be sure to like, subscribe, and comment below. I'm gonna draw on my Wacom tablet, but you can follow through my tutorial with any other media that you have, whether it's pencil color, sharpie, or crayons. So I'm gonna start with drawing his hair in the center, with drawing a curve line up, and then turn it to the side on the right. And then we're gonna go down towards the eye and then we're gonna make a sharp turn back up in the same direction where we came from and we're gonna go back down at the side now on the left side I'm gonna draw another strand of hair to in the direction of his left eye so I'm gonna draw a curve downwards and slightly above the level of the first strand on the right I'm gonna stop and then I'm gonna turn back up again the same direction and stop there and then for the left side of that here, I'm going to draw another curve line from this point here to the side of his face and then I'm going to turn back there I'm going to draw another strand on the side similar shape but on the top part I'm going to make it bigger and stop there the above the strand of hair on the right and the curve line to the right and then it extend it outwards at the corner here and I'm gonna draw I'm gonna make a sharp turn back to that hair there below that I'm gonna draw another line below like that the above that strand of hair I'm gonna draw another one and to the center above like that and then another one to the back here and this one is slightly smaller like that and then at the side of the head on the right side here I'm going to draw his sideburn from this point down then make a sharp turn back up and continue that all the way towards uh, in between the hair and then the same goes to the left side here we're gonna draw another similar like that and then another strand of hair at the side here we're gonna draw that all the way up to the center of the part parting of the hair and a curved line here now for his cap I'm gonna take this point on the top left corner of his hair and draw a curved line up and then turn it to the side to the right and I'm gonna go down on this corner and then for his cheek I'm gonna take that line from the um, sideburn and draw a curve line downwards and stop there and the same goes to the left side here 
So I'm gonna draw his fingers on his cheek. So we're gonna draw a curved line from this point and draw to the cheek and then make a semi-circle turn there. Another finger on this side. And the last finger, I'm gonna extend that all the way to the sleeve down there. And from the front part of the hand, I'm gonna draw a curve line to that point there. And then below the hand, on the front part here, I'm gonna draw a curve line down and then turn it sideways. And then make a semicircle turn at the bottom part there. And the, in the, for the inner part of the hand, so we're gonna draw a curve line down. And I'm gonna draw from this point a semicircle to the sleeves. Now we're gonna repeat the same thing on the right side as well. Now in the center of the face on the bottom here, I'm going to draw a curved line from the sleeve to the chin and then go back up to the right side. And then for his ears on the side, on the left side here, I'm going to draw a curved line on top and then extend it to the side of the face there. And for the inner part of the ear, on the top part, I'm gonna draw a trace the line there. And then at the side of the at the side burn, I'm gonna draw a curve line there. I'm gonna repeat that on the right side as well. Now for his eye. I'm going to take from the right corner of the eye here and draw a curve line across to the front. Stop there. And turn it downwards at that corner. Then at that corner on the top part, I'm going to draw a small curve line across like that. And then we're just going to make those upper line upper line of the eye thicker and thinner as you go to the side of the eye now on the bottom part of the eye and the curve line there and for his pupil I'm gonna draw a, an oval shape here And another and a circle on the top part there and for the center of the eye we're gonna draw another small black oval right there so for his eyebrow on the bottom part, it's more straighter than the upper part, so I'm going to draw from this point here to the center, like that. And it goes upwards in the center there. And the top part, I'm going to make it up on the corner, and here as well, and more of a straight line in the center, like that. So I'm going to repeat the whole thing on the right side here. Basically, the whole shape of the eye will be slanted more on the outer corner of the eye.
And for his mouth, I'm gonna go across the curved line here. And his nose, we're gonna add a curve line on the bottom, a small curve line there, in the center of the face, and another one on top. Now in the at the bottom of his chin, I'm gonna draw a triangular shape downwards. And then on the side, we're gonna draw from this point here a curve line to the side and out. And then turn it back to the side of the face. Same goes to the right side. And then below the arms, we're gonna draw on the left side here a curve line down. And then make a semicircle turn at the side. And we're gonna draw the same thing on the right side of his outfit here and we're gonna join the bottom part across with a curvy line so for his pants we're gonna draw a curved line on the side all the way down to the shoes and then we're gonna draw across the bottom side of the the pants across and in the center we're gonna draw a line upwards and in the center I'm gonna draw a curved line across and then for his shoes I'm gonna draw a curved line to the front tip of the shoe and then a curved line downwards for the heels of the shoes now I'm gonna connect the front part of the shoes to the back with a curved line and slightly above that base I'm gonna draw another line similar and on the front part of the shoes I'm gonna draw across a curved line like that now repeat that for the right side Now on his knees, his jeans, I'm gonna draw a rectangular shape there for the ripped jeans and also the right side here and then for the details of his shirt, I'm gonna draw from the color, the side of the color here, triangular shape, diagonal line to the center on both sides and repeat that again and again and another one on the bottom part and that's all for our tutorial today I hope you enjoyed the lesson and find my videos helpful be sure to like and subscribe to this channel also feel free to let me know of your request suggestions or any other comments in the comment section below.